This might be a very good reference book for you. Finally, how to solve the posterior. The posterior is very, very difficult. So, think three-dimensional. If you cannot think three-dimensional, watch three-dimensional. Call me CD. You'll be able to appreciate its severe dynamism, buckle displacement, and very, very deep. So, Dr. Thomas Martin, what's your treatment plan? Touch. Pretty tight, isn't it? So, refer to me as an option. The oral surgeon suggests take out everything and restore with two dental implants. If you do that, you run into a risk that you might fracture the medieval body. So, what is your treatment plan, Dr. Monaghan? Can, can you fix it? Can you? Before you answer that, let me remind you, this dimension of good is down below the medieval canal. If you want to bring that up, it might tear the nerve, and it is no fun to do. So the best way to answer this question is go back to the history. And the answer has been well documented in American history. The answer is, yes, yes we can. So, first I do a surgery, remove the baby tooth and the you turn out to be compound odontoma. And finally, we wait for five months, the first premolar erupt, and 13 months, the second premolar erupt, nine millimeter. And we wait the other seven months, it stopped. Why did it stop? The explanation will be Bone remodeling here will get the bone harder and harder so the austere class cannot chew the bone. If the class cannot chew the bone, the reasonable approach will get the austere class to first to the austere class. So you just grind the bone, you only need two minutes. So you can bond the attachment with little while. There are two key for that adequate bone reading. Removal, precise force direction. And how about precise force direction? We're talking about buckle shear screw with 3D labor arm. With this 3D labor arm, you'll be able to solve the problem. And remember, he was told that it was impossible. I said, really? <laughs> Five months after the second surgery. It reached the occlusal surface. So, I consider it's minimally invasive approach. I love minimally invasive approach. My patient love it, and we wouldn't. How to activate it? I use white guard to activate it. When you activate it, you want to make sure the force level is about four ounces. With that four ounces, then you try to adjust the point of application is supposed to be right in the center of the ridge. So you, when you bring that up, you won't hit the buckle plate, you won't hit the dingo plate. One more tip, Chris. How do you bend this 3D level arm? Is that difficult? Believe me, it's a piece of K. So get a 19 by 25 stand steel, and then, oh, get a 25 by 19 by 25 stainless steel, I bend the first helix to store the energy. Then you bend the second helix to change the direction from buckle to middle of the ridge. At the end, at the in middle of the ridge, you bend the third helix to facilitate tightening, to facilitate tightening the attachment. And you're done. It only took you about 45 seconds. And with this Mini school and 3D level arm, you'll be able to solve this complicated impedicuspid. And can you imagine that 
with this approach, the severe digestive root, 17 months down below, can be solved within 25 months. Without this mini screw and 3D diagram, it would have been possible to do that. So, to conclude today's lecture, there are six key to success. Number one, diagnosis and treatment plan. I'm talking about Dr. Jong Lin's three ring. Bounding position, talk selection, wire sequence and timing, and light elastic. If you use light elastic, I suggest you to use biturbo, divide and divide table, open by posterior light table. Finally, I will encourage you to put school in your repertoire because for complicated case that break it alone cannot solve the problem. With this school, it will be easy for you to save hundred, uh, several months of frustration. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm not trying to tell you you should use school in every case, but when the mechanic call for it, you have it. That make huge difference. So, all the information can be found in this journal. And the good news you can download here or watch my video in Newton say 0301 or get a hard copy. Ladies and gentlemen, it has been a great pleasure to talk with you today. Thank you.